My name is uh, Matt Lentz. I have been tattooing for about eight and a half years. I got into tattooing um, kind of on accident. I had a bunch of friends that were getting tattooed and I had always been into art and planned on making art in some capacity. The first shop that I started tattooing in was uh, Bulletproof Tattoo in Spokane, Washington. Uh, dude's name is Swanee. He's, uh, he's a good guy. Um, I learned some stuff from him. I think one of the most valuable things that I learned was how to make needles. Uh, that was that was key. As long as I've been tattooing, I've always been into like really interested in, in tattoo machines, machine building, and uh, you know pulling them apart and putting them back together. I just want to know every aspect of my trade as well as I possibly can. I've always been most uh, into and intrigued by the traditional American and Japanese style tattoos. Uh, I have a tendency to draw stuff with those influences. I'll try to make each tattoo appropriate for the client more so than anything. Uh, you know, before I got into tattooing, most of the stuff that I, the art that I made was really loose and, and abstract and kind of uh, not not graphic or tattoo style imagery at all. It was really artsy, artsy crap. And I would actually like to really get back into making that kind of stuff again too someday, but it'll happen. Everybody here is super awesome. Uh, I'm really uh, thankful to be able to be a part of this shop. And I hopefully will be able to be motivated by my, my coworkers and uh, be able to encourage the people that I work with a little bit, you know, help each other to improve as tattooers and artists. I'd never get sick of tattooing skulls and roses. There's a lot of different, uh, you know, ways that you can draw a single rose. I love roses. If I'm not hanging out with my wife, or tattooing, or drawing, I'm, I'm probably thinking about drawing or tattooing or machine building, or hanging out with my wife. <laughs>